try nothing stupid. I wouldn't do that if I were you. Don't do it. <laughs> no. You were following us. Yet, all the police went after us and we took them down. Right? And you were the only one left. From the way I see it. After I saw you, I decided to take you into questioning. I wanted to interrogate you, but now the villain said I can do anything I want to you. In this state, you will select like you're injured really badly. And look at you. You're a cop. Let's defend the city. In reality, there's no heroes. Not anymore. <laughs> the way you look is hilarious to me. You know, I keep thinking how you cops survive. I don't know how you guys make it. But in reality, with us around, you really don't make it. You wanna know why? Because all of you wanna just defend the city. And literally, when you show up, you're literally asking for a death wish. <laughs> no, what's wrong? You look scared. I thought you'd be braver than that. Aren't you brave? <laughs> well, I guess I thought wrong. Get your tied up to a chair. We kidnapped you. Let me just interrogate you for a little bit. What did you see when we were trying to rob that bank? And what did you hear? You didn't think I know you were back there watching us with your partner or whoever. I saw you. You really didn't have a good hiding spot. <laughs> oh, you're a 
just talking about robbing multiple banks. Each day is a weapon. And you know about the weapon we're trying to build. Hmm. What else do you know? I know we talked about a lot more stuff. Mm. Mm -mm. Don't lie to me. I know you were still there. <laughs> you look nervous. Why is that? Are you afraid of what I'm going to do to you? Do you have a family? Free. Do you have a husband? Two sons, one daughter. Does that sound familiar? <laughs> you got scared. I know a lot about you. After I found out you've been watching us, I saw your name on your badge. And I decided to look you up. Just in case this would happen. And it did. So now guess what? You don't tell me everything you know. I will destroy your family. And I will break you. Mentally. And physically. Do you want that? Hmm. Well then. Tell me everything that you know. Mm -hmm. mm. So you know every plan that we're trying to do. You knew it. Well, it's not everything that you told me. You don't know nothing else. <laughs> I love it when you cops just try to lie. And you don't think I'm smart enough to figure out what you've done. I don't know what you really did. Come on. Just spit it out. Hmm. All right. I didn't want to have to do this. This is one of my favorite knives. And I love it. It's a really good knife. I thought they killed so many cops with this. It's really entertaining to me. I feel a sound. You hear that? What if I just use this on you next? Oh. These are all the names. People I killed with this knife. 
cop names. Paul, Jacob, Lizzie, Tony, Elisa. It's a lot. Do you want your name on your necks? Then tell me everything. No, you didn't tell me everything. I know you stole something from me. Just spit it out. And show me where it is. And you won't get hurt. Mm -mm. It's too late now. It's too late. Let's put the duct tape back on you so you won't scream as much. I'm gonna do this slow. Just so you can maybe enjoy the pain. Hold still. That's what happens. We don't do what anyone says. You want me to break you some more? On my count, there's still a lot more body parts I can break. What is it? <laughs> now you'll tell me. Okay. Show me what did you steal? Ah. It's in your cop car. I don't worry. I'll go get it. I'll be right back. Okay. You did steal it. I figured that. You stole half the money and some of our weapons. And there's my weapon. Maybe I should cut off your hands next. Hmm? No. Thought that was a fire alarm for a second. This is a truck. But you want to know why I shouldn't cut off your hands? You don't think I've been watching you? There's cameras in here. 
I see that key in your hand. Give it to me. Thank you. See, that's what I want you to do, is just cooperate. Like how cops want to cooperate with us. Why don't you cooperate with us? Shh. It's okay. I know you're in pain. I know you're in pain. But you brought this on yourself. Just remember. Luckily, the villains will be pleased by this. Should I break you some more? Just for the fun of it? Or should I just let some of my villains? Should I just let some of my villains try to get to you? Stolen a lot from us. Just trying to be a hero. But really, you haven't been thinking about yourself or your family. I could go after your family next. <laughs> Ooh, you got some fight in you. You are a fighter. But in reality, you're really weak. He just tossed you into the ground. Hmm. I'm going to have so much fun with you. Maybe destroying your family. But really, I'm going to destroy you first. So I really hope you not experience pain. It's the way I see it from your face. You probably don't know how to. So, here we go. Huh? Hold on, I'm getting a call. Oh. Hello, Todoroki. Yes, actually, I found the cop that's been doing this. I'm kind of busy with her. What do you need me for? Mm, okay. I'm on my way. Oh, yeah, you know what? Tell one of the other villains they can probably interrogate the cop. Because I know she knows a lot more things. Yes, she's lying. She knows a lot more. What she told me. Just keep in mind of that. Okay. Bye. Well, you got off easy a little bit. But never villain's probably gonna torch you next. I know you know a lot more. I'm not stupid to understand. I paid attention to your every move. And don't worry. Even if you try to get out of here through windows, there's no windows here. For the door, though, just if you open it, let's let you know. We learn to a trap. Not telling you what the trap is, though, but it'll be fun. With all the stress going on with you, you should probably get some rest. 
when I'm gone, if I do come back, I want to see if I can get some more answers out of you. Covering this up.